Welcome to Battletech with the mod Extended 3025. We are currently at Safeport, and this is Dr. Obsidia with you today. Thanks for joining again. Last time we left off, we arrived here, ran a mission, and now we're going to be doing the next one. There's several missions to do here, but why don't we up the ante a little bit? There is a Double Trouble mission, which is a duo duel. One million credits? I guess you can call them credits, right? Um, we have a million sea bills, so yeah. One million sea bills. I've been playing Swatter Star Wars The Old Republic too much lately, so uh, I go with credits. But one million sea bills for this. I'm sure they're sending good mechs at us. One out of five salvage and in the desert climate. So chances are there's going to be running hot. I um, would like to pull something, whatever that is. So we're going to go ahead and drop down here. It's three skulls, very dangerous mission. But with only two of them, we might have a shot at this. We're taking our Thunderbolt, which is a tank mech. The Lance is a 65 ton limit, so that's pretty much what we're up against. So I think we're going to run King Wolf in here because he can manage the heat a little bit. And he's pretty decent at what he does. Now for the next mech to bring in, what about we just throw it all into the uh, pool right now and say, let's go for the FS Brawler. <laughs> um, question is, who do we want to pilot the FS Brawler? Somebody with good piloting skills. Probably Bonsai uh, is a good choice for that. Um... Kopesh would not be too bad because they could stand and still punch as well. Uh, we don't really need to do, do the sensor lock, so I think we might go for Kopesh. Kopesh doesn't really have any experience in the brawler. But we would let, want somebody who can move, and Kopesh can also move and fire. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, so, this is only a 35 ton mech, but hopefully... Uh, we can keep them moving, and uh, you, know, you know what? Let's drop Kopesh out. I think Moped is our main person here, and that's really what we would want to have in here. But I think Steeljaw might be okay for it, too. And the reason is uh, they're fatigued. But um, I think it might be worth it just because we can get the... Or maybe we should just go with Moped and let her run it. Yeah, let's go ahead and just bring her in fatigued. She retains her evasion, so she's going to be mobile. She's going to run around. The problem is the Thunderbolt's going to take all the shots from the big mechs, and the Brawler's going to be running around harassing them. So we'll see how it goes. He's probably going to warn me here. Nope. Going to let us drop. 65 ton is the max limit for the Thunderbolt. And we're way under, 30 tons under for the other one. Let's see how it, how it goes. This is really dangerous considering it's a three skull mission. Command interface initiated. However, our brawler hits way above the weight. So uh, this could either turn into a spectacular victory or a slugfest where we lose some of our good mechs again for a long time, or it could turn into the worst nightmare we've ever seen. Understood. Still don't see the enemies. Yeah. Of course we're going to reserve. It's a bad sign if they're all moving at the Reserving second action. level. Wow, okay, well the King Wolf can move up. On. We're in the trees. That's a good sign. Yep. Uh, if we get out here, we're going to get lit up. Um, We'll move over a little bit. We'll just walk and sensor lock so we can see what we're up against. Confirmed. Before we advance. 
a rifleman. No retreat. Well, they run pretty hot in general. Is everyone just going to reserve? What one? do you need? Move the brawler up. See if we can sensor lock again. See what the other one is. A Jaeger mech. Bunch of AC2s, AC5s. Dangerous. Orders. We can see... <laughs> we can see from here. Let's see, what can we fire? A 60% AC5. Yeah, I mean, if we're just going to target them from this range, we'll take that shot. 60%. Engaging. Missed. Reporting negative damage. We'll reserve down to them again. See what they do. Okay. Yeah, they're not going to let that go. Good to go. We're actually in a pretty good position right now. If we move up, I don't think we can... Yeah, we're going to go ahead and move up. We're on a side. Let's go ahead and fire everything. Roger. Good hits there. Starting off strong. Rifleman's closing in. Big hits on us there. Don't worry, we'll get in the tree line. I'm under heavy fire. Yep. Moped can't quite get there, but moped can maybe open fire on the rifleman. Look at that. We're gonna go ahead and call a shot there. Um, let's see what we are up against here first. Rifleman's got a large laser on one side. Probably going to be mirrored. Large laser. Medium laser. Yeah, it's, it's pretty much a mirror of each other. The ammo's in the center torso. That center torso is hard to hit, though. It's got a lot of armor on it. I think we could probably just center torso this thing. 54% chance to hit it with everything we've got in the center torso. Got a searchlight. Alright. Let's see what we're looking at here. Yeah, we center torsoed him pretty good. I think we're just going to run up to him. Um, punch him right in the face. Yeah? Still in the trees. His right leg is destroyed in a single hit. <laughs> Lots of outgoing damage. Yeah, I got your other searchlight. <laughs> Didn't see that coming, did you? Yeah, this guy's scary though. Look at that. Big hits on our Thunderbolt. Huge hits. Taking heavy hits, Commander. Waiting for orders. Let's get that Thunderbolt in the tree line as fast as possible. Confirmed. We're gonna go ahead and uh, vigilance. We lost a lot of armor. We're gonna center torso this thing and just try to kill him. Taking the shot. Didn't work. That's too bad. Oof, 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 look at that. Oh, look at that. He's wobbly. It's go time. <laughs> yep. It's go time. We could hit the Jaeger mech in the rear arc and just leave the firemen alone. I think we're going to go ahead and do that. I'll do what I can. 
Leave the rifleman alone, not fireman. <laughs> oh, lost your right torso. <laughs> Lots of outgoing damage there. Nice. Aye, aye. Part of the reason for that is um, I'm going to move forward. I copy. Again, we're going to precision strike this guy's center mass. Everything we've got. That. There we go. We took him out. One left target. Woo! <laughs> He's running for it. He needs to make some space. Let's hit him hard. Not too bad you can't get away from this. Heading out. We messed up his rear armor real bad. Ah. <laughs> Knockout. And some more for good measure. Wow, that was gotcha. impressive. Gotcha. <laughs> Mission successful. Good deal. There's some pretty big mechs there, and our brawler just manhandled them. Would have been a real fight if the Thunderbolt would have taken some hits. Uh, some more. He, I mean, he was close to losing that torso armor. His arm was looking pretty weak, too. He was taking big hits. Look at that. An AC triple plus, which we badly need. Although we can get two parts of this rifleman right here. Oh, what should we do? Let's see, that AC Triple Plus is not uh, valued at that much, but they are hard to find. But two pieces of a Rifleman means we can almost put together another heavy mech. Um, the Jaeger mech is really nice. Good torso. Or no, I'm sorry. Good uh, damage output. Good heat efficiency, which is really good. And the Fireman... Uh, rifleman. <laughs> I can call him the Fireman. Um... Partially because his heat is terrible. But how can you turn down two rifleman parts? Hey, we got the AC-5. Nice. I wish we would have got the, the Jaeger mech, though. I'll take the AC-5. Ripple Plus. Love to put that on something. Says we need some repairs. I don't think so. Must be an artifact of the mod. Thinking that, whoops, thinking that we need repairs when we don't. Yeah, I don't see anybody that needs any repairs at all. Unless he's talking about the other stuff. Alright, that was a good fight. We got some good stuff out of it. Thanks for joining. I want to wish you guys a happy new year. Hopefully 2021 is going to be much better for the world than 2020. So wherever you are out there, and if you're watching this, thanks for joining my channel. Thanks for watching my content. And I wish, want to wish you the very, very best 2021. Please stay safe out there. Uh, make sure that you don't get around uh, any big crowds and things until this thing kind of evens out uh, and we get some uh, safer environment for us to live in. You guys have a wonderful new year and take care of yourselves. Catch you in the next episode.